Hi guys! Well, my hubby is helping me video this today, and we'll see if it looks better than when I try to do it myself. Uh, so, the Stitch Fix box came a day early, and I'm really hoping this time that they uh, listened, they read my note, the stylist read my note, and looked at my pins. I pinned a lot of current, uh, you know, Stitch Fix stuff on my pins and I wrote a note and I made sure my you know profile was right uh, because last time everything was too big and they didn't send me anything that I wanted or asked for etc so I'm hoping this works okay stitch fix it's kind of a you know pretty square small box it feels heavy so maybe I had asked for wedges Nope, let's see them. So this is what I asked for before I opened. I asked for wedges. I didn't say all of these things. I said some of these things at least. Um, cut off jean shorts, uh, jean skirt, and I asked for the brand Just USA because they sent me in my first box a white pair, that a distressed pair that I absolutely love. The fit is great. Um, so I asked for colored, distressed Just USA jeans, jean shorts, skirt, summer color colorful wedges cobalt blue purse if possible uh sundresses or summer shirts with um, maybe a built-in bra if possible so um that's what i asked for and of course get the card get the envelope and it does not look like there are shoes in here and so i see cobalt blue that's exciting so we'll see. And I always like the oh hello. And can you see that? I don't know if you can see it or not. I'll just go over it. Looks like they sent me a jersey dress and it looks kind of long sleeves and a velvet knit top, which velvet, it's mid spring. It'll be summer and a little over a month away. I don't know why. I mean, this is New Jersey, folks. A long sleeve cold shoulder, it looks like. Looks like they did send me a colorful jean or pant, although it doesn't look distressed like I asked for. And a long sleeved, looks like a sweatery kind of top in a blush color, it looks like. And a busy print, which I said no busy prints. Uh, everything looks kind of more like something for someone else and certainly not for spring and certainly nothing that I pinned or requested with the note. All right, we'll see. Let's be open-minded. So they do wrap things nicely, I'll say that. All right, I love cobalt blue and I did ask for a purse and I did put it, I, I have a pin, under my style board saying favorite colors and cobalt blue is one of them. This is Jersey with a lilac, uh, lining and a very frou-frou sleeve. It's very, it feels heavy. I can't imagine it wearing today on a rainy day in May, let alone as it warms up through the summer. I don't know the cold shoulder, sure, but long sleeves and it's, it's heavy. The color is gorgeous. So we'll try it on and see. This is not a cobalt blue purse. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, and this is a very, oh, it's very see-through. I don't know if you can see. I don't like, and it's long sleeves. Uh, very drapey. I don't like a lot of stuff around my waist and hips because I am curvy and it looks way too big. It is a medium, it looks like. I don't know. Yeah, it's a medium. Light pink. Don't, I like, I did say rose gold, like metallic rose gold. And I do like uh, saturated colors, which I also said, like geranium and tropical pinks. Uh, this might be another letdown. It's looking like it quite, like even more than last time. Wow, this is another jersey. 
and it's a medium again. I don't know what they're doing. I told them if it's stretchy, I need a small. I feel like they're not reading my stuff. And I did check to make sure. It does look on the small side, so maybe it's a junior size medium. It, do it doesn't look like a medium, but it does have a lot of stretch. Oh, it also has a zipper on the side. It's a very busy print. It's black and white uh, with a, kind of like a plum purple. And it could look really cute on. I am curvy. Uh, and sometimes this style here, when it goes like that, it almost looks like a wrap dress, except it has a zipper instead of a tie, which it might actually be very pretty. But again, for spring, like a day to, like today, I could probably wear it if it stays just like it is right now, but this is not a spring and certainly not a summer dress. This is a fall to winter dress, but it could look really cute on. So definitely I wouldn't pick this print or those colors. All right, I do love, this is like an olive color and I, I'm sure I said on my Pinterest that I like olive. I like all greens, but velvet this time of year, I don't get that. The V-neck is very flattering, and uh, it's another medium. I don't know. It's called Z Supply. Uh, you know, it's like a plain uh, T-shirt kind of thing, a little longer. I don't know what I would do with velvet this time of year, but I'm going to be open-minded. We'll see. And I asked for a bright, happy color. This is more like a muted red. Or like a deep, deep rose. I don't know which. Like a red rose color. There's no distressing, which I asked for. And it's Lakeview Denim. It's not just USA. So it's size 28. And there's not as much stress, stretch as a just USA. And this is a fake pocket which is not really skinny jean in my mind. That's more like a jegging. Um, so it's, it's not the right kind of jean. It's not distressed and it's not the brand, nothing. So anyway, we'll, we will see again. We will try these on and I will just see what the stylist said to me in her little note, because this is very strange. It's not Nicole, it's Sabrina. I had Nicole the first two times. Hi Sarah, happy fix day. I read through your profile and spent some time looking for, through your Pinterest when I was putting this fix together for you. There were a few requests that I wasn't able to find for you this time around, but next, but rest assured, I will keep my eye out for everything you are looking for. Oh, I did ask for a black jumpsuit. Also, the last two fixes and I didn't get it. And we can work together to get these items to you in the future. I know that you are looking for a pair of colorful Just USA skinny jeans, and unfortunately I couldn't find a pair in that brand. Well, I said distressed color. However, I did snag a great pair by Lakeview Denim. Give them a try, and with any luck, like, luck you might have a new favorite denim brand. Uh, I have a lot of colorful jeans with the fake jegging kind of pocket, so this is, no, I don't think so. Uh, for this fix, I relied heavily on one aspect of your Pinterest board, color. Well, the only color that's right is the cobalt blue. All the other colors are not really. I mean, I like the green, but velvet? Uh, well, taking cues from all of the other info and inspo you provide it. Let's work together to make each fix better and better. XO Sabrina. I don't know whose board she looked at, but my Pinterest board shows none of, none of that except my, you know, my favorite color is one of them is cobalt blue. So I don't know. I don't know how much time she actually spent. Okay. I'm talking too much. I'm clearly disappointed. I'm going to try to be open-minded when I do the trial. Okay. So this is the uh, velvet tea. And it's actually very comfortable. Um, are you getting my whole you thing? So I happen to have all of um, wedge shoes that I got on QVC clearance. And uh, so it's nice. This is an interesting color combo. 
not something you would see a lot of other people wear. Uh, this is, I feel like this is a very saturated deep rose color. And even though I'm very disappointed that they're not distressed, I will say that they're very light. So for spring, summer in New Jersey, this actually may be a very good pant. When you want to feel like you're wearing a jean, but you don't want the thickness of a jean. Um, I, I love a pocket when I need a pocket, but there are back pockets that are there. And uh, they're 28, they fit pretty good. This is a medium and I guess I don't have a big, big bust, especially since I lost weight, but I'm like a 36 C. And I guess that's why she picked a medium. I tend to like things a little more fitted, but with this style shirt, I think this is the appropriate size. Um, you know, small if it was shorter and I was gonna wear it with something over it would be good, but I think it okay, actually- Okay, so I just kept the same jeans on. This is the kind of blush pink top. It's, uh, it's really too long. I know that that can be a style and you can juju it up. This is, um, even though it's got all this drape, it's still, I, I kept my same bra on the black. I'd, I, I'd have to wear like a nude color bra, but I still think, you know, it'd be a little see-through. Uh, but maybe with the right color bra, it would be okay alone without something underneath. Uh, this is much more flattering than I thought. It's, I thought it would be very bunchy, but the way it's cut up, it is kind of a pretty drape. Um, I don't mind a little thing covering my butt or part of my butt, but this feels way too long for someone who's five foot okay, two. So here's the fourth piece. I just kept the same pants on just to save time for myself. Um, cobalt blue, it is beautiful and it feels really lovely on. Um, it's way too heavy for most spring days and certainly summer days in New Jersey. I, I would wear this in the winter or maybe early spring. I do love the color. Um, the first fix that I got, um, they sent me a frou-frou sleevey uh, navy, and this is cobalt, but like, I, I think they should kind of look back to see what they've already sent. I do like it way more than I thought I would. The color's great, and I'm trying to figure out, with this kind of cuff, you'd think they'd have a button here and that you could adjust it because it's 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 just too long like if i'm going to be doing anything besides maybe dancing um that would be really fun but if i was going to eat anything or even drink like it would just be clumsy at a bar or at a table or whatever i do like it a lot and um hi guys this is the last piece um it is kind of like a wrap dress like i said but you get this nice zipper. I do love the feel of this dress. It feels more like fall winter again. It does have like a three quarter length. Of, well, on me, it's a little longer than three quarter length, but I could certainly. Okay, guys, I really didn't finish this properly yesterday. So uh, I'll just do a quick review of the prices and stuff. I don't really think I did a clear full job of it. So, um, this is the Z Supply shirt in uh, olive, and it's called Amani Velvet Knit Top, size medium, and it is $48. I think that is way too much for um, a t-shirt. I mean, it's pretty, but that's a lot of money. Um, and I, you know, when I did the profile, I did say, you know, the cheaper the better. So I'm surprised they would send me um, that kind of top for that price um, and then this this one is truly poppy um, the Gianna cold shoulder blouse in cobalt blue it's also a medium and this is $32 and to me that's a more fair price for for what it is it's the cold shoulder the sleeves it has a pretty little button in the back that matches um, and it's well lined it's, it's really none of these pieces I would pick for me or for this time of year. And I know you're supposed to, you know, part of it is to have a stylist push you past your comfort zone, but I am pretty daring anyway. I don't really need the stylist to do that. I was hoping to get some of the things I requested um, and I didn't. 
this is the Vero Vero Moda Lucali Wrap Front Knit Top in Light Pink, and it's a medium. I definitely should have had a small in this. It's it's really too big. It does look nicer on than I expected it to. Um, this front part really looks prettier on the body, um, but this back, it's like a square. <sighs> It's like a square, you know, it goes down longer than the front and it's just squared off. And the front is so prettily draped and, you know, with a curve, I wish the back was curved also and maybe not so long and big on me. Uh, definitely um, a small. Um, that's $38. I guess that's a reasonable price um, for, for that. It's pretty thin though, you know. I think if it was aligned, it would be better. Uh, okay, so then the next uh, was a Lakeview denim, and it's called Alex Colored Skinny Jean. And uh, I was wondering yesterday what the color really was, and it, they call it a dark pink. And this was the correct size for me. This is a size six, uh, $78. I don't normally spend uh, $78. I'm sorry, $58. Uh, I don't usually spend $58 on jeans because I tend to wait for the sales or clearance items. Uh, they are really nice jean and they, they are um, lightweight for this time of year. So, you know, it's, it's kind of, I was pleasantly surprised how they felt on. I, I don't like a fake pocket I, and I know the concept and why, you know, it's uh, a real pocket adds bulk and all that kind of thing but I do like a if it's a jean I want a pocket but anyway uh, $58 I normally wouldn't spend but they are a really nice jean and then the final thing was the 41 Hawthorne dress in a really busy print um, it is I felt like it looked nice on me and it felt comfortable and it is lined also and it has that zipper detail uh, it's, it's a nice dress, uh, $78. I don't spend that kind of money on a dress unless it's phenomenal. Um, again, I'm good at finding a sale and a bargain, but uh, I have paid full price for things that I really, really love and that are really, really special. Um, but again, I don't think for spring, summer, this is, it's heavy and long sleeved. Everything felt like it was more for somebody else and uh, not for this time of year. So with uh, the total would be 254 and the 25% off if I bought all five pieces is 63.50, making it 190.50 and then I had $100 worth of credit. So what I would actually pay if I choose to buy all of these would be $90 and 50 cents. Um, if I'm thinking about it, and these aren't all things I would pick up and say, yeah, yeah, I want this. If I was like at Marshall's or TJ Maxx or just any department store and they were having a good sale, I could probably find twice as many items that I really, really liked for $90.50. So I'm thinking that I'm probably going to send them back. It is my birthday today, so I think I'll wait till the end of the day to make my final decision. But uh, I'm really disappointed that Stitch Fix, um, they say they looked at my Pinterest. I, I spent a lot of time uh, posting on my Pinterest style board um, things that I wanted, things that I liked. And I, you know, did the profile. I've been taking the Stitch Fix uh, style quizzes. Um, and I also requested, you know, you write a note to your stylist after... Uh, your fix, you know, for your next fix, and I requested denim jean, or uh, cutoffs, uh, a distressed jean, colored, uh, a jean skirt, a wet, summer wedge, a cobalt blue purse, uh, a black jumpsuit, and uh, maybe a sundress and or summer top, possibly if, if they could find it with a built-in bra, but still, I didn't get any of those things in any way, shape, or form, except the color cobalt blue, but in a roughly long sleeve thick top so uh, I don't like being disappointed I don't like feeling like negative but it's just the honest review uh, this is my third fix so and 
don't know. We'll see. But anyway, I hope you have a great day. I plan on it. Uh, and mm, till next time. Bye.